well, when you've got money, you can treat your children and you ain't got to look over your shoulder knowing that all your bills are paid and things are going happily. Jean, sorry, what? I asked you if you were coming out with us tonight after work. Sorry, I can't. What did she say again? She said she can't come. I told you. I can't. I can't see my dad. Can we do it next week? You said that last week. Did I? Yeah, and the week before that. Like from seven in the morning till nine of the night. It don't matter if you ain't got any money, you still got to pay this bill while you get summons and take and court dates and things. So yeah, still nearly fifteen, still borrowing money off me mum. Right, I'm off then. Don't forget I'm seeing Granddad tonight. He's had the council round today. <laughs> I bet that made him happy. <laughs> you know what he's like. Can you get your own dinner? It's weaker than a food bank in there. I'll pick something up when I go shopping for Brandon. See you later then. How's the flat hunting going there, Tom? No landlord will talk, talk to me until I pay what I owe. I've got a parcel with you at the counter next week. Don't no, sorry. Well, make sure you go this time. That's what they're there for. Yeah, I will. But first, I'm going to call your son. Mum? I've already said I'll pick something up. You know I prefer going at the end of the day. It's not that. Can you lend me 20 quid? What for? Nathan subbed me last night and I need to pay him back. I haven't got it, love. Oh, come on, Mum, it's embarrassing. You, you know you'll get it back. All right. But how long is he going to be living on our couch? You heard him. They'll sort him out next week. He hasn't got anyone else. I know, and I want to help. But he can't stay here forever. You're supposed to be saving for university, not going out every night. I don't need to. I can get my loan then. My friend Lucy's been on holiday twice. It's not free money, Bruno. You have to pay it back. Only if I get a job. Thanks, Mum. <laughs> Say hi to Grandad, yeah? I had to be signed off work for six weeks because of my job, I couldn't do my job and applied for housing benefit and they basically told me I weren't entitled to nothing. Kappa? Oh, nice one, Connor. That's alright. Do you like these two? I'm joking here, Jean. <laughs> They're well nice. Thanks, love. I'm taking up a collection for Nettie. How much? Five or each. Thank you. Thanks. We should buy some lottery tickets. Why don't you give us some money? If there's a roll up there tonight, opportunity to win a million quid. You give us some money, she can treat herself. Well, you'd pass up a million quid. Tab, can I do Nettie's shift till she's back on her feet? Sophie's taking them all as soon as she heard. You can stay on tonight though, because Tony's called in sick. I can't. I need to go and see Dad. You can have my shifts on Wednesday if you like, Jean. Don't you need them? Going to the house in benefit, aren't I? Should be there all day. First thing they say to me is, Are you working? It's like bloody chasing shadows, Jean. Thanks, Jean. That's alright. I don't like to put that burden on friends. Regardless of how close me and my pals are, it's a burden. I see, I see it as a burden. Dad? I'm in the bath. You want a hand? No, I do not. I'll get dinner started then. Hey, Dad. How was the council? <laughs> To put a rail next to the bath. That's good. Is it? I told you not to go up the loft without Bruno. I was on the roofs for 25 years before my knees gave out. I'll bet you a week's pension that rail doesn't last a year. Are you not eating? No. I'll eat with Bruno later. Dad, where's your big TV? Turn me eyes. 
So is he working yet? I told you. His friend Nathan got him a casual job at Foot Locker. Casual? Work isn't meant to be bloody casual. What's he doing with the rest of the week? You bloody spoil that boy. He's going to university in September. I'm just trying to make the most of the time I have left with him. He's not dying, Jean. He's going to bloody Plymouth. I don't think your mum wants me crashing on your sofa anymore. Ah, she's alright. She's just worried about Grandad. Oh, I can't believe you blew your rent money on this. They didn't want me to spend it, then he should have put my account. <laughs> Is that work? No. Good. You do too much. You need to look after yourself better. <laughs> People will start thinking you're my wife. <laughs> I'm in trouble, Dad. What do you mean, trouble? I owe money and I can't pay it back. I'm scared I'm going to lose the flat. Oh, Jean. What have I told you about borrowing money? We've raised you better than that. I just wanted to do something nice for Bruno when he passed his exams. The holiday? You told me. That useless git of his father paid for that. He hasn't paid for a thing since the day he didn't have to. I put it on a credit card and I was paying it back every month and then I lost my job and I fell behind. <sighs> you should have said something. I was too embarrassed. I knew you'd be cross. I'm not cross. I'm bloody annoyed. How much do you owe? The original loan was 800 but then they kept up in my limit. Oh, come on, man, I'm starving. We can do a pizza. I haven't got any money. You can owe me. I can't take that, Dad. That's yours and Mum's money. You work for that. And we never owed a penny. So I've got some to give. Take it. It's not even enough. No. But it will buy you some time to get it sorted. Dad, I'll pay you back. I know you will, love. <laughs> I'll pick it back. Bruno's probably starving. Good. Tell him to get a job. No way. What? You know those two girls we met when we were on holiday? Mm -hmm. They're in town and want to meet up. I can't. I haven't got any money. You do remember what they look like, right? Look. Boom. Boom. Bam. Y can you cover me? I just spent it on pizza. Can't you ask your mum? She's being weird about money at the moment. Payday loan. What? Payday loan. I does it all the time. Look, got that app on my phone. No way. Why not? You only need to borrow 30 and I know where we can take the girls this cheap. I don't know. Mate, it'll be rude not to. Support, really, when money's not there. Like, with the, your housing and your bills and that support, really, rather than just throw you to the lion's den, as I call it. Hello. You're Jean, are you? I am, yeah. What can I help you with today? I've got into a bit of trouble with money and uh, I need a bit of help. I need our help. Right, shall we start just from the beginning then? Do you have a list of your outgoings and incomings? 